Hey, what's up everybody? It's your boy Jason Yamamoto. Check this out, man. So, I was given this topic to discuss about Boston Lloyd giving advice to Jason Genova about taking a steroid stack made by Boston Lloyd. Boston Lloyd went even as far as making a little PayPal thing where, you know, if anybody want to support Jason Genova taking these, uh, drugs and helping him make his bodybuilding career come true go help him out and start donating money to him on his paypal so jason genova himself can start taking these drugs right there's a few things that jason blaha said on his video that I agree and don't agree you know I'm not going to say that Jason Blaha is right all the time. He has his right to express his opinions. Should drugs be illegal or legal in pro sports? In my opinion, hell the fuck no, man. First of all, fuck that bullshit. I do not want steroids to be legal in pro sports. You know why? Because there's guys literally in pro sports that doesn't want to take drugs. You can't force somebody to fucking use drugs and then you have him compete with against a whole bunch of people who's on drugs. I'm not saying it's cheating, but it's not fair because some people want to stay natural the whole way. You know what I'm saying? And, you know, it's just, you know, it's not, I wouldn't say it's fair, but, you know, you got to keep it fair. And I would say just keep it illegal in pro sports. You know what I'm saying? If you're going to make it legal... Make a whole new version of the NFL, NBA, whatever, man. You're going to have to make, like, the enhanced NFL sports team. Not just, you know, NFL in general. But in my opinion, nah. I don't want that shit to be legal. Anyways, man. Let's get into the, uh, to the uh, topic. Okay. What I think about Boston Lord telling Jason Genova about using steroids, man. You know, some people say, man, stay natural. Some people say, stick the needle. You know, my advice to Jason Genova, you know, I have him as a friend on Facebook. I like some of his pictures. I like the little stuff that he does, man. Jason Genova, to me, is a legit entrepreneur. He's trying to make something out of himself. You know what I'm saying? The thing is, check this out, guys. You know, it's his adult decision. He's not a little kid. It's his adult decision if he wants to start sticking himself with the needle. Okay? That's the thing. But you got to also understand that you can damage yourself with certain amount of antigens. You know, I don't think I would take advice from Boston Lloyd. You know what I'm saying? Because he doesn't know many of the difference of steroids. I think there was like a post that he did a while back, I think earlier this year or something, or last year or something, and he was talking about how if it fits your macros is retarded, and he was talking about antigens and all kinds of different stuff, which most of it were antigens, and DHTs, whatever, man. I think... <laughs> I think Boston Lloyd is the wrong person to uh, go to for steroid advice. I'm not saying that you can't go to him. I'm just saying for Jason Genova, go to a real pro uh, coach, like who, the ones that coach Jay Cutler. You know what I'm saying? Or Ronnie Coleman. Something like that. I wouldn't want to go with a guy who is apparently still like 21 years old coaching people to use steroids. <laughs> you know, that's just my opinion. But uh, if you had to stick that needle, man, I just got to let you know, man, I wouldn't advise using any of the stuff that Boston Lord even told you to use because each steroid has a different effect and you don't know what kind of effects it may have on your body. You could use the anabol, right? And all kinds of fucking kinds of uh, uh, different side effects might happen to you. It may not even have any side effects on you at all. Trembolone. An aggressive style of uh, of uh, animal steroids. Not even human. It's not even meant for humans. But it, there might be some side effects. You gotta understand that. It, you may get it. You may not. 
don't know. You know what I'm saying? T3, same thing, test. Just because a lot of people had good success with it does not mean you're going to have good success with it. And he's telling you to hit all these stacks as if there's no side effects on you that's going to happen to you. Dude, that's not that's not the advice, homie. You got to understand. You got to take one, one thing at a time, man. Take T3, see if it works for you. Don't work? All right, cool. Don't use that again. Test. Same thing. Works for you? Awesome. Doesn't work for you. Throw it out the window. And you gotta remember, man, when you start making these things, you know, when you start taking these things, you know, these taking these steroids, you gotta understand, man, your your uh, natural testosterone levels ain't gonna be the same again. You gotta understand that. Once you hop on this shit, you can't just say, I quit. You know, it's like going into the mafia, man. You jump in the mafia. There's only one way out, man. Through the box. You gotta understand that, man. Hopefully, you'll understand the consequences. And, you know, you might raise enough money for this for these drugs for the first time. You think people is going to keep donating money for you for the second time, third time, fourth time? I told you. You may get your money the first time. Shit might work out for you. But then now you're stuck. Now you gotta get more. You gotta keep getting more. You gotta keep getting more. You don't even know that shit's gonna work for you. And if it does work for you, you gotta be careful, man. You gotta be careful. These things can hurt you, man. They can have horrible side effects. People die from this shit, too. You gotta keep that in mind. Really discuss the possibilities of side effects with your physician or doctor, man. And see if this is the right path for you. I like your physique. It might be a little bit fattening. But I like your physique, man. It's not the best physique. It's not Frank Zane or Arnold Schwarzenegger. But you know what? It's your physique. It's your own aesthetics. Appreciate your own aesthetics. Don't worry about what your fans say. They're not your real fans if they really want to make you do this. Alright? It's just advice for me to you. You don't have to take shit. Alright? Second of all. For Boston Lord, man, dude, if you ever fucking give out a stupid ass advice like that again one more time, reevaluate your current position, man. Do you really care about human life or do you only care about money? Because right at this point, man, you're looking real stupid with this current advice. Bef and you know, I like you for your honesty, but I don't like you when you're trying to hurt other people's lives, dude. Because you know steroids ain't a game, man. It's not a game. Alright? So that's just my opinion, man. Jason Genova, rethink your situation. Rethink your options. There's so many options you can go by 10 years. You know what I'm saying? Do your thing, man. Anyways, man, it's your boy Jason Yamamoto, and I'll talk to you guys later. Nice. 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 Nice.